investigating a deadly shooting on Rachel Street. Let's get out to wake up Charlotte's Richard Devane. He's joining us live there from the scene with the very latest. Richard, tell us what else we know so far. Very few details that we've just given. Yeah, we, we've gotten just an update from police, but uh, we actually spoke to family members off camera who told us that uh, while this uh, scene looks like it's clear here, police are still on the investigation trying to determine exactly who killed their loved one. Now, the person that they told us was is the victim is this person. Let's take a look at this person, Corey Miller. They say he's 48 years old, and he was found in a driveway after police got a 911 call. As we look at video, this all happened around 1240 this morning right here in the 2500 block of Rachel. Street. When police arrived, they found Miller laying there suffering gunshot wounds. They say he was pronounced dead at the scene. At that time, police went about the business of trying to determine exactly who did this and why, trying to collect as much evidence as possible and speak to anybody who might have seen anything. But at this time, we can tell you that police say that as of yet, they do not have any suspects. The family is pretty torn up because they don't have any answers on what took place because uh, the detectives and no one is telling anybody anything. They need help from the community, um, people that live here on this street. Somebody heard something, somebody know what took place. Yeah, the plea from the family, basically someone probably does know something, and that's what police are hoping to find out. Of course, as we get more information, we'll give it to you. We'll be back in about 30 minutes with another update. But for now, we're live right here on Rachel Street. Richard Devane for Wake Up Charlotte.